guys welcome back to my channel it's time for the weekly manicure and this week's design is gonna be roses no those are not roses <laughs> these are just flowers i got from our company yesterday they are just leftovers from the barbecue so they gave them to the people before throwing them away so that's why i have them here They're just really nice flowers so i wanted to have you a look at them as well and enjoy them the design is inspired by my wedding bouquet which looked like this it was all red roses and one blue rose it's just because i love red and blue that's why we decided when we got married to do it like that it's been a while since i got married but every year for an anniversary i get a bouquet like that with red flowers and one red rose and usually if it's not if, if there is no blue rose available then my husband gets me something that looks like blue anyway so this is what I'm gonna do today and what do we need polishes as usual starting with a base coat the Essie helped me grow. I need to get something else because it's almost empty now. Then I have already put on two coats from this Nails Ink Effect Color, which is one of these Ballet Shears, and this one is Covent Garden Ballet. And I hope you can see that it's really like shimmering in this pink, yeah iridescent shimmer going on so it's a more subtle color but I will stamp on it with red and blue which will then of course make the red and blue pop a little more at least that's what I have in my head for the design I hope it works out like that so I'm stamping I'm gonna be using today this Jollyfin stamping polish it's red glitter really really glittery polish but you can use any other red iridescent or glitter polish for my blue I don't have a blue polish that's that dark so I'm gonna be using this Essie really really nice color it's called Aruba blue and it stamps really nice I have used it before for stamping and you can see it's also really shimmery kind of like blue dark dark blue color really nice one gonna need some top coat of course I have already top coated my nails here before stamping as usual so you can remove any mistakes that you might make more easily then I'm gonna be using my rectangular Moyu London stamper scraper and for the stamping plates today I'm going to be using this Leslie plate and it's called LS17. This is the single blue rose that I'm going to be using, this one here. And for the red roses, I'm going to be using Moyu London Mother Nature number 06, which has all these mountains, little houses, balloons, but one mountain is made up of these roses and I really like them so that's what I'm gonna do as usual it's gonna speed up the video while stamping so sit back relax and enjoy see you later
Ross, but Kristen, the security video that Desert Spring sent us, you were helped up by a woman. Then what fall was he talking about? I, I don't know. And I'm back, everything is stamped, top coated, and I really like how it turned out with the one blue flower in between. So I hope you like that little design from me. And well, I wanted to thank you for coming to watch my channel again. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And See you next time. Ta-da!